to join in Yui's Bokyap channel. So, as you notice, we didn't change Bokyap, Bokyap no. We changed it to Joy and Yui's Bokyap channel. And we couldn't really get rid of the word Bokyap. So, please be it na lang. And, uh, I know that you have already an idea what would be my topic for this video. But before I jump to that, allow me first to extend our gratitude thanks to everyone who supported this channel. Thank you, thank you so much guys. This far that we reach couldn't be possible without your support and thank you thank you so much and um Lewis and I are really grateful for reaching this far we just have started this platform for just a month and we have already this number and thank you thank you so much and for everyone who dropped by to you know put comment on the course in the comment section you will be shouted out in the, by the end of this video so thank you thank you so much that's the only way we could extend our gratitude to everyone so um just wait na lang for your name to to be mentioned to be shouted out here on our channel so previously i have shared with you my first tip on how to take care of your bully or your puppy which talks about proper diet and good nutrition and I also shared some products or dog food which we serve to Bokya which is now popping on your screen so some products that we serve to Bokya during her meal and um, if you haven't watched it yet the link is in the description down below apparently I know that you have already an idea no I have said it already what would be my topic this of this video because you know, the, the, the title is already written in the title section and I know that you have already an idea with that so before I jump to that before I begin if you enjoyed watching my video my previous video and if you want to watch more videos here on our channel and if ganahan pa mo tanaw sa ako, Please subscribe, like, share, and click the bell button below for you to get notified for more upcoming videos na entertaining, funny, and, and informative here on Joy and Yui's Bokyap channel. So let's start! On my previous video, I have said that it is important to give your puppy a proper diet and good nutrition because of course that should be your to do as a far parent and also that is very important because that would be the moment especially when they were still puppy or young the moment that they started to build and form their muscles when they grow up speaking of grow up it is very imbalanced if we would only focus on their nutrition and diet so we should also have to consider other factors to maintain their well-being so as a puppy owner, we should also be their voice anytime, most especially on what they feel, what they want, what they don't like, and what they love. Because that is the moment when we could update ourselves to their current status physically. And speaking of physically, my tip for this video is relative to physical aspects at ang puppy. So there are people sometimes um, tend to not perhaps put their soul and mind to it because maybe they don't know how important healthcare monitoring is or they just don't care um dili mo tanan but there are some really ngon ana and to enumerate my tip or my this segment my follow up tip for monitoring your bully puppy or your puppy or different type of puppies then i will be sharing this video to you the most search and things that is important for healthcare monitoring. How important is healthcare monitoring? There are actually a lot of ways to take care of your puppies, and one of which is to closely monitor their health. As of our parent, most of us is really looking for ways to improve and help them to live longer. And one of the effective ways to extend their quantity and quality of life is to really closely monitor their health. And that is a really important part of ownership. Paying attention to small changes to your puppy can really help them to live longer and an early intervention can really prevent them to serious condition. Getting a health baseline 
started for your bully is not really as difficult as might seem because all the information that you needed to monitor their health is really right in front of you. Paying attention to and recording all the information in monitoring their health can really help to keep your far baby healthy. And of course, be the voice of your bully too. Be sure to keep tabs on your puppy. Keep a small binder or a notebook so you can keep track all your puppy's or bully's health information. Or if you don't have anything, then make use of your phone as much as you can record their diet, their weight, their medication, and changing health concerns. It is very important to monitor their day-to-day -day habits like changes in personality, eating, drinking, routine, and bathroom habits which can signify a problem. Cure Puppy's health monitoring is one of the powerful tools to help them to live longer. And if you haven't practiced it yet, then be sure to start a health baseline record for your puppy. And that is how important health care monitoring is. In addition to feeding your puppy, other aspects of general care that are needed to keep your puppy healthy all throughout its life, these include veterinary care like vaccinations, parasite control and dental care, and or grooming and protection of household hazards. Puppies need veterinary visits usually every three to four weeks until they are about four months or it depends on your veterinarian and your veterinarian may recommend a wellness program if your puppy may have a condition that is needed for attention. Since you are more familiar with your puppy than anyone else, then you must have to watch it carefully for subtle signs of illness that another person or even a veterinary may miss. Some or usual signs of illness include um, lack of appetite and decrease of activity. And there are also some specific more signs of illness. And these are vomiting and diarrhea, um, urinating more or less frequently, coughing and sneezing, and even these include um, discharge of fluid or something on their eyes, their nose, and their ears. And sometimes this kind of illness or signs of illness show up on your puppy as a lack of hair and an itchy part of their skin or an area of their skin or around their ears. If your puppy shows these signs for more than a day or two that couldn't be prevented with um, home remedy, then a visit with your veterinarian is a good idea. Most of the puppies will readily eat a peel that is hidden on their food such as a piece of cheese or on their treats or on their dog food. Liquid medication are also sometimes prescribed, particularly for puppies. Liquid can be given via a syringe into the rear of the puppy's mouth by inserting the tip of the syringe near to the back teeth on either side. If your puppy needs an eye drop or ear medication, then your veterinarian must have to have a demonstration or will assist you when you are the one who is doing it. And regardless of all the type of medication or how it is to be given, you should have, it is very important that you should have to read and follow all label instructions, of course, for the benefit of your puppy. So next, for giving medication is the vaccination which is the very key component of preventive medicine for all dogs just as in people and newborn babies they needed um, vaccination immunization and all other vaccination types of vaccinations same with puppies they also need it for of course for their immune system to boost their immune system and vaccinations are given to stimulate the immune system against infection before exposure to disease and of course guys you are advised especially to the newbie far parents if your puppy is just um, less than a year or less than three months then you are not really advised to expose your puppy outside 
because of course they needed to you know boost their immune system first before exp- the exposure to any diseases around them so for their for their advantage and health benefits so you should have to be mindful for that and what else um, several vaccines are routinely given to dogs as the core defense against serious infectious illness such as distemper parvovirus and rabies and one of the common ones the parvo and uh, that is the very very dangerous um, disease that every puppies or dog or hybrid dogs could ever experience and to be able to let your dogs away from that so you should have to really really indulge your puppies into vaccinations for their for boosting their immune system and next would be the parasite control which is the very very also common one so that every far parent should be um, reminded for to do this regularly for all of your puppies okay because of, of course there are parasites inside of your puppy and that should be discharged from their body inside of their body and for them to maintain their health right so it is really needed to have to deworm your puppy so just just a little bit of uh, knowledge about that it is not really necessary to to consult to your veterinarian if you know how to do deworming your puppy and if you really didn't know so you must have consulted your veterinarian but if you have an idea or knowledge on how the procedures on how to execute it with your puppy then you can do it by yourself this is included for monitoring the health of your puppy which is the dental care you are not actually necessarily mandated to go to the the clinic for dogs or for your veterinarian but you can actually do the hygiene of your puppy so dogs need dental attention throughout their lives of course they need it and you can also help keep your dog's teeth and gums in good condition by feeding dry food providing certain toys or brushing your dog's teeth regularly and following a program of professional dental cleaning and oral care performed by your veterinarian but actually the one that i mentioned the most common one that is very easy to do as a far parent is this one dog's teeth um, brushing your dog's teeth regularly which could be done at home so if you have your spare toothbrush then that could be very possible to be utilized for um, brushing your dog's teeth and another would be in monitoring the health of your puppy is grooming so if you're owning a very hairy puppy then this one is very very important also because your dog's hair coat should should be brushed regularly to remove shed hair and prevent hair mats so na mag-iusahay na magkulot-kulot na ang hair sa tong puppy because um, we irregularly brushing their hair so grooming is very important too and not just brushing but um, cutting the hair of your puppies because it is very necessary because their eyes were already covered with their hair or for some reasons so grooming is also one of the things that should be monitored as part of their health okay and also it is not especially if there are parasites on their skin like so aside from that aside from uh, the their hair their far cover already covers their eyes or their nose or their ears but also um there are some parasites on their skin you are all familiar with that garapata one of the parasites of the dogs no so to also avoid them to stay longer and for us to remove them and we could visibly um, remove them on their skin so grooming is also also necessary and another would be in monitoring their health care is the household hazards there are actually a lot of hazards that they could be able to meet on their natural actions because you know dogs are dogs and puppies are puppies they are energetic and like you cannot really control their energy so there are actually reasons why they could be at risk because of their you know natural energy owner that is spraying some medicine that could might 
you know poison your puppy you should let them away from that and if there are sharpie or pointed things that might you know your far baby or puppy is to be wounded so keep the things away from them or if you really want to make them away from any danger then put them in their cage or move away all the those things that might gonna hurt them and might gonna um, cause accidents to them so for that for them to be to be really safe so just guard your dog away from those hazardous things as i promised everyone who drop a comment on the comment section will be shouted out today's video and since i'm about to end my video so here in my hand already the list to all the people who will be shouted out it's kind of plenty but i don't mind it so first will be shout out to chema balgos chema balgos was used to be the original human parent of Bokya. so we actually bought Bokya from chema balgos with her boyfriend kokoy another would be ramon kayanong the third who broski mira notaza rick's vlog teka tv men's curry curry akorinto al dave grace bmm channel loveless badang vlog glory fi karucha so the dark sea erica is dang barakula al vlogs brandon alara elamera ben buds 58 francis marvin mang m abigail heart leaf plant mom pink january phil war vlog biscuit vlogs gambal ni rosa 25 ginang buki jonathan paul tv lily joe vlogs key japan travel theodore tv family vlog sir om tv mitch fam ako si ellen ac manang liza jane vlogs Fun made channel Arnel Lahot, Team Kalian TV, Mabini Hunter, Zai Francing, Glenn Day Official Yabagi's Vlogs, Marikri's Vlogs, Biahini Aye, <coughs> Mets and Cassie Channel, Katcha Vlogs, Egypt Life Vlog, Mama Norm's Kitchen, She Herrera, Handot Gaang, Chris Shishi, Juicy Kuyo, Kendranic Mamadra, Slim Cheney Vlogs, Kathleen TV, Kian Cool, Mark Chan Tuliao Official, Mary J TV D, Loreto De Vera Jr., Franz Mix Vlog, Rodel Idea, Abigail De Yota, James Ryan Hat Hayahan, Mi Jane Ayubong, Aristio Hironelia, LG and Mom, Kalagas TV Vlog, World of G, Luminous Jade, FVP Vlog, Rossi Tampus, Mama Elaine Joy Lagan, Mini Foodie Show, Makauragon Vlog, Ka Gamers by Lon, KD35 Vlog, Margie Ilonga Vlog the Third, Panda, Lawrence's G, CTV, Gov Videos, Alex Joan Vlog, Murphy and Cassie, Buhay OFW by Gloria, Janet Channel, Banks Journey, Bean Vlog, and Alice Reyes. So the people that I've mentioned, most of them have their own channel so please guys please subscribe to their channel and also if you haven't subscribed them yet then maybe it's your chance to subscribe and help them to grow their channel and thank you thank you so much guys and i guess that ends my video so thank you so much for watching and i hope you enjoyed it and you learned something from it and for more upcoming videos i hope you are still there watching and supporting and of course guys before i end my video please subscribe like share and click the bell button below for you to get notified for more upcoming entertaining informative and funny videos here on joy and lewis bokeh channel thank you <music>